Hi, my name is Dr. Rod Mitchell. I'm an anaesthetist here in Adelaide. I'm also the immediate past president of our college and I currently sit on our college council. So on today, National Anesthesia Day, I'd just like to state how proud and grateful I am for the fact that people living in Australia and New Zealand can enjoy what is truly world-class care in anesthesia and pain medicine, and, and it really is world-class. But today and every day, I'm always ready to acknowledge that not everybody has the same access to that care and that we need to do all we can to address that. So for our patients, what matters is not the care that they could receive, what counts is the care that they do receive. And sadly, some people will receive a lesser level of care than others. So for example, we need to do all we can to make sure that people living in rural and remote Australia have access to the quality of care that we would expect for ourselves. We need to make sure that people who often are living on the margins of our community, such as large parts of our Indigenous community, such as people who come here seeking refuge from persecution, asylum seekers, such as people for whom English is a second language. We need to make sure that we're doing all we can to ensure those people also have equity of access to that health care. And then we need to make sure that the 5 billion people living globally who do not have access to the anaesthesia that's required to undergo life and limb saving surgery, that we're doing all we can to address that problem. So on this day, and on every day, I'm always ready to say that we need to do all we can to identify those obstacles and barriers to people receiving excellent anaesthesia and pain medicine care. And we individually and collectively need to be doing all we can to address that. Thank you. Have a good day.